GovGuam now faces a June 30th deadline to get $120 million in financing for the lots in landfill or once again face paying millions in weekly fees and backed payments. The governor's financial team spent much of this morning in closed-door meetings preparing the paperwork to market the landfill bond and the deficit financing bond linked to it under the legislature's funding bill. But with conditions on the bond market improving, Governor Felix Camacho's staff say they are confident GovGuam can meet the deadline. All of the, the, uh, the bond council and the underwriters are very confident um, that when the uh, issuance for the uh, general obligation bond, the pay for our debt financing, as well as the ORDOT uh, consent decree uh, projects go out, that we will see um, money come into the territory and those will, bonds will be sold at that time. With the end of the weekly fees, GovGuam's plans to cut spending through putting employees on furloughs and other measures are being put on hold for now. This is due in part to a provision in the legislature's funding bill that will let GovGuam recoup the almost $7 million it has paid since the fees began through bond money. However, GovGuam officials say spending cuts could be necessary later. We're not letting our guard down as far as uh, keeping frugal and still looking at the things that we may have to even to um, eventually uh, perhaps have to implement uh, barring the worst case scenario um, which would be not to be successful with the bond. Meanwhile, as the threat of the fees return looms in the not so distant future, Senator B.J. Cruz says he is weighing the prospect of an appeal in the landfill case. I have an attorney looking into it uh, currently. I'll be meeting with my colleagues at some point soon to ask for their assistance in underwriting the cost of this appeal. But I have someone looking into the issue of what can be appealed and what the uh, possibility of success is. But Senator Ben Pangolinan disagrees that now is the time for an appeal, saying one would have been better sought earlier in the landfill case. Stefan Sebastian, PNC News.